Connor McHugh, you look pretty good on the um, driving range there. Yeah, plenty of practice. Uh, was a member of Bally Castle and now a member of Cushendall. Do hurdlers make good golfers generally? Uh, depends who you ask, more to the point. <laughs> Some of the boys play golf, but uh, like Kieran Clark, he, he's very good, must say. I'd say the majority will be cat handed unless unless you've any uh, hurdlers to actually hold. The left hand at the top of the hurdle will be all right in golf, but <laughs> I can't say there's too many I'll have bothered to change for golf. And watching this morning, uh, what do you think of these lads? Uh, I think we're I think we're safe enough with <laughs> with the ones we've seen this morning, but uh, I think you'd need to watch out for a couple of players like Kieran Kieran Clark, maybe from Bally Castle. He plays um, fairly regularly, and there's a few maybe ex players that that aren't uh, part of the panel this year. Neil McCauley and uh, Paul Shields as well are usually there thereabouts and sort of up near the top for the prizes. So. Well, it's great to have the boys from uh, the Antrim Herders here. Um, you know, every year we try our best to support them as best we can. I mean, they do great with their sponsors. Um, I think generally they sort of get a great turnout. And, you know, for us as a, as a club and company, it's, it's fantastic. And, you know, we're more than happy to offer as much support as we can. And as a bit of a golfer yourself, I mean, would you recommend this particular course as somewhere that people should go and, and have a great day out? Oh, yeah, this, this golf course is great. Like, it's, it's tricky. It's, there's, there's water here, there, and everywhere. I mean, just the rough... It's it's hard to stay out of, and at times you just have to make sure you hit the ball straight. How important is this as a fundraiser for Antrim? Oh, it's vital. It's been done uh, for the last number of years now, you know, and uh, you know it, it's uh, unbelievable to support the Antrim hurlers get from it, you know, and it's vital in our preparations coming into the championship, you know, just that off the back of a league campaign, you know, it can't be understated. So, of all the fundraising that goes on, how important is this particular day? Um, the, this is a massive day for the Antrim herders. Um, uh, so just it's it's been running for four or five years now, um, and it's a it's like a calendar date and for our, for our year now. So um, the, all the players and everyone around the county expects it to be on. They know it's going to happen. And uh, Galgarm have been very good to bring us in and the, at this course. And you know the they have like the the NI Open is played here. It's a really really popular, really good course and. A lot of players don't get the chance to play here any other time of the year, so um, no, it's it's just a really good event, and we look forward to it every year. And it's a good chance for us to get out and meet people and meet the supporters and and uh, just have a bit of crack with everyone. So it's unbelievable, and all the hurlers are extremely grateful, you know. And uh, anyone we've asked and anyone we've went to, they'll be more than happy to sponsor the hurlers, which is, is great to see. You know, everyone in Antrim really rolling behind the hurlers. I mean, it always promised to be a good day. I mean, the guys are here. Um, we've just got the Castle Kitchen and Bar. It's just been recently refurbished, so the guys will be able to go up and have a bite to eat and a few drinks if that's what they're, what they're into. I mean, it's always well attended. The guys enjoy themselves. And, you know, the course will always be set up as always pretty perfect, so there'll be no complaints that way.